My name is Leslie Tejas, and I'm the owner of Eat Mexico, which is a culinary tourism business uh, based in Mexico City. Huilacoche is a fungus uh, that grows on top of an ear of corn. Um, it's basically a blight. It's considered a blight in the U.S. here in Mexico City. Um, in central Mexico, they eat it as a delicacy. Um, so basically, it's this kind of puffy mushroom, a bluish-grayish color, um, that will kind of take over the ear of corn. Um, almost like you know, it looks very kind of alien, otherworldly when you actually see it on the corn. Um, but it has kind of a really intense mushroom flavor. It's kind of like mushrooms on steroids. Not really like any other mushroom you've tasted. I think it, it's really unique. Um, usually people eat it here. They put it in a taco or they'll cook it with, they don't eat it raw, they cook it with um, onion and a little bit of garlic and um, maybe some, some regular corn, corn kernels, and maybe some rajas, which are charred poblano pepper strips. But you stew it all together and, uh, and then you eat it with corn tortillas and a little bit of salsa. I've also seen a lot, um, like a fettuccine with a wheat la coche cream sauce, that seems to be really common. Um, again, at these kind of mid to upper scale restaurants. Wheat la coche is a mm, part of the uh, mm, history of Mexico because it's part of the maize. The maize is the basic crop of Mexico. Corn smut. <laughs> yes, corn, corn smut. I just think you have to look at it as a, a new exotic food. I mean, it's definitely... Wheat La Coche has existed in Mexico for thousands of years. It was a pre-Hispanic food. You know, it existed before the Spaniards arrived. You know, it is something unique and interesting and something you will only find in Mexico. And that gives it some cachet, I think.